All right. Time to customize our hawk. Uh, I'm going to let you guys sit in on this if you want. Otherwise, you can just skip ahead. But yeah, let's find a, find a, a preset first. How about that guy? Yeah, let's work with him. Uh, what kind of skin tone do we want? Do we want to be a black man? Caucasian man? Something in between? Asian? Uh, I like this one. Kind of toned. Not quite as pale. Yeah. No tattoos. Because... Um, I think the twos are for elves, so I'll leave that. Hair. Well, I want bushy eyebrows. So those. Uh, I want to have black hair. I usually have like brown hair, like yeah, like that. But uh, I'm going to try something different. So there. Stubble. Yeah. And I think that every epic hawk needs a beard. Every hero needs a beard. That's just the way it is. And I think I found some someone in the demo that I like. Yeah, there we go. I'm sure there's going to be plenty of pretty boys running around. Uh, you know when other people create their hawk. But I want mine to be kind of worn, maybe 30, 35 years old. Uh, not a supermodel, but a uh, cool kind of guy. He looks kind of like Duncan. Uh, what kind of hair do we want? We want a, something... I think something worn, or something unkept, I think. Look, it's Duncan. Uh, I don't know what to... Oh, wait, what was that? Yeah? Hmm. That's not unkept at all, but... Yeah, I'm guessing his... I'm guessing his sister helps him with... <laughs> helps him with his hair. So... Yeah, how about that? Fits with the beard. Yeah, I kind of like it. Not too sure about the little ponytail. Is there some other straight kind of hair? No? Is that what we have to play with? Oh, here's something. Still with the uh, things. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with the little ponytail thing, I think. Yeah. I kinda like it. His hair combed back. Oh yeah. Skin complexion. No. See here we go. Again. A little bit worn. Uh, eyes. I want strong eyes. I have, I have small eyes in real life, so I want to compensate. Yeah. I think that works. Eyes, eyes. Not too big, though. Let's go there. Color. Again, I have green in real life, so no, not green. Kind of brownish, maybe? Like that. Oh, that was nice. Bro. Oh. Is it? Oh. Oh, how well, about that? Looks good, I think. Uh, brow height? Kind of low, I think. Or angry. Surprised. Angry. Yeah, there we go. I like this hawk already. 
Nose. I want a broken nose. Can I get a broken nose? Oh, very strong profile there. But I don't want a, a perfect kind of guy. Oh, there we go. He's been using swords his whole life, and uh, he probably broke his nose when uh, fighting with his brother at some point. Yep. Nostrils. Do we have? Yeah. There we go. A little bigger nose, I think. Yeah. Not too big, though. But not too small, either. Well, how about that? Oh, the tip works. Maybe a bit... What does this... Oh, okay. That's somewhere around there, I think. Yeah. Damn you, brother, for breaking my nose. You know, that's what that's what happens when you play with swords. And his sister helps him with his hair. So that's great. Neck and ears. Yeah, I can't change these things. Mouth and jaw, of course I have a beard. But you know, an epic beard wins all the time. Ah, oh, what do you guys think? Yeah, I like him. I like him. Portrait. Oh, it must be this one. Looks kind of nice, don't you think? Background, how about... Dark green, light green, light green. Works, you can see the details. He's a very down-to-earth kind of guy. Very very brown. Not too sure about the hair yet, but I think it, I think it works. Yeah, yeah, it does. Just comb it back so it gets out of the way. Behind the ears, tie it up. Yeah, yeah, it, it works. It works. Name. Let's take my favorite name of all time. And it's not David. Alexander. That's it. That's such a cool cool name. Uh, events of Dragon Age Origins. Import. Yes, please. Kale. Yeah, that's me. Yeah, this is the witch hunt. Is that the last one? Let's say 154. Yep. The nest. Plot summary. Alright. So this is what happened in Origins. Uh, Connor was freed from the demon. Mages were recruited into the army. Dalish elves were recruited into the army. Haramount rules Orzammar. The Anvil of the Void was destroyed. Loghain was killed, Alistair is king of Ferelden. Uh, the Warden performed the Dark Ritual with Morgan, bad boy. Uh, the Warden killed the Archdemon. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, 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 Amaranthine was saved from the Darkspawn Assault. The Architect is dead, the Warden's Keep was reclaimed. Shell was discovered, King Caelan's corpse was burned. The Warden joined Morgan to travel through the Illuvian. Yeah, that's my game. That's my world. Congrats. Thank you. Well, this is it. Alexander Hawk. Time to get busy. Here we go. Select difficulty. Casual, no. Normal. Yeah, I'm thinking hard, actually. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to regret that. But I read on the forums, the Bioware forums, that normal is mostly just you controlling your own character, and the other characters can, can use their abilities and stuff, and you, you'll be alright. 
and hard is for the more tactical thinker. Uh, you have to use all your whole party uh, to achieve victory, and uh, I think I, I, I like that. And uh, I'll, I'll remove all the AI because uh, if something goes wrong, I want it to be my fault, not the game's fault. Uh, which means I have to be very observant of what I'm going to do. So yeah, <laughs> I'm sure I'm going to regret it, but let's go hard. The Blight had been unleashed on Ferelden. Dark spawn poured out of the wilds, clashing against the army at the ruins of Ostagar. The battle was a disaster. King Kaelin died on the field with his men, betrayed by his most trusted general. Unopposed, the Horde marched on the village of Lothering. The village burned, and many innocents were slaughtered. The champion's family barely escaped in time. Go, go, Alexander! I think that's all of them. For the moment, make us save us. We've lost it all. Everything your father and I built. <laughs> and uh, a nice little detail here is that uh, you can see that my sister <laughs> actually have smaller breasts now, because uh, the dwarf exaggerated that part as well. <laughs> well. I know how much Lothering meant to you, but we have to move. Yes, you're right. We she should looks have different. Gone sooner. Why did we wait so long? Sorry. Why are you looking at us? We've been running since Ostagar. I really shouldn't talk over the conversation. <laughs> uh, and there, uh, she looks different as well. I think that has to do with the the uh, the, char the main character's appearance. Well, speaking of running. Not to interrupt, but the blight's not going to wait while we stand here pointing fingers. Please, listen to your brother. Then let's go. Lead on. And I'll probably put on subtitles as well next time. Because I think this is a great place to stop. Yeah, <laughs> You haven't seen much gameplay, but uh, that's, that's for next time. Now you have a nice introduction into the world of Dragon Age 2. Next time, it'll be adventure. So, I'll see you then, and thanks for watching. I'm not sure we can survive much more of this.